thank you so much for joining me for Family Storytime. My name is Caitlin and I work at EDPL Oakland. Before we get started, we're gonna sing our hello song. It's to the tune of If You're Happy and You Know It. If you're ready for a story, clap your hands. If you're ready for a story, clap your hands. If you're ready for a story and you really wanna show it. If you're ready for a story, clap your hands. If you're ready for a story, stomp your feet. If you're ready for a story, stomp your feet. If you're ready for a story and you really want to show it. If you're ready for a story, stomp your feet. If you're ready for a story, take a seat. If you're ready for a story, take a seat. If you're ready for a story and you really want to show it. If you're ready for a story, take a seat. <clears throat> Great job! For our story time today, you're going to need a scarf or some sort of small dishcloth or something like that. All right, let's go ahead and get started. Our story time for today is all about mermaids. So our book is by Kate Pugsley and it's called Mermaid Dreams. Have you ever dreamed about being a mermaid? or maybe swimming in the ocean and seeing all the different kinds of creatures that you would see down there. And look, we have some on the back too. We have a squid, looks like a puffer fish, and a dolphin. That would be a lot of fun to see, wouldn't it? Maya loves the beach, and there she is. The air smells fresh and salty, the sand feels warm and soft between her toes. Maya and her parents settle into a spot near the ocean. Will you play with me? Maya asks. Maybe later. We want to relax now, says mom. Why don't you make some new friends, says dad. Looks like dad's sitting back, maybe taking a nap. Mom's reading a book. They're ready to do boring adult things like relax on the beach. From her turtle floaty, Maya watches the other kids having fun, but she is too shy to say hello. Aww. Maya listens to the waves flow in and out. She wonders what it's like deep down on the ocean floor. Her eyes grow heavy and she closes them against the sun's bright rays. Looks like she's getting sleepy too. What do you think she'll dream about? I don't know, let's find out. Maya suddenly feels a cool breeze against her face. She is riding the waves on her turtle's back. The water sparkles like jewels. And what do we see here on the horizon? Looks like a yellow boat. Maya and a turtle dive below the surface, swimming down, down, down. At the bottom of the ocean, she discovers a secret underwater world. And look at all the colors and the different sea creatures. What kind of colors can you find? Yeah, I see blue and green and red and yellow. Very nice colors. Some gray up here, black and brown. Maya slides off her turtle and realizes she can swim just like the other ocean dwellers. She's a mermaid with a beautiful blue tail. Look at that. Her dream came true. Maya hears a voice floating out from the coral. Hello. She spots the glimmer of a yellow tail. Who could that be? When she swims closer, she sees, what do you think she sees? Oh, it's 
It's only a fish. Its scales are sparkly, but its personality is dull. It's just a fish. It doesn't really do much. Maya hears the voice again. Over here. She spots two eyes peering out from behind the coral. She swims the reef to discover. What do you think she finds next? Hmm, let's find out. The eyes belong to an octopus. It has eight wonderful eggs, but it can't hold a conversation. Yeah, I don't think octopi are much conversationalist. What do you think? Maya hears a giggle. He he he. She sees bubbles rising up from behind the rocks. She follows the trail and swims right into what do you think she'll see next? A herd of seahorses. They're silly, but they can't laugh at her jokes. And how many do we have here? Let's see, we have one, two, three, four, five, six yellow seahorses. <clears throat> then Maya sees an unusual shape in the distance. It floats closer and closer. What kind of shapes do you see back there? I see jellyfish maybe? And then there's another shape that kind of looks like Maya. Hmm, let's see. It's another mermaid. You found me, the mermaid says. And look at all the colorful jellyfish that they're around. Great job. It's your turn to hide now, says the friendly mermaid. One, two, three. Maya swims into the underwater jungle. She finds the perfect hiding spot. Her eyes grow heavy watching the seaweed move with the current. Oh, it looks like she's getting sleepy again. <coughs> Got you! Maya hears a familiar voice and looks up sleepily. Hi, I'm Pearl. Do you want to play with me? So, look, her mermaid friend is actually a real life friend as well. I always want to play, exclaims Maya. Let's pretend we're mermaids, whispers Pearl. And that's exactly what they did. So look at that. They found each other underwater and on the beach. And now they're playing pretend mermaids. The end. Great job. Before we get to our scarf activities, we've got a short song. It's to the tune of the wheels on the bus. But it's called the waves in the sea. Are you ready? The waves in the sea go up and down, up and down, up and down. The waves in the sea go up and down all day long. Oh, I see a little fish. Can you be a fish? The fish in the sea go swish, 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 swish. The fish in the sea go swish, swish, swish all day long. Uh-oh. Here comes a shark looking for some tasty fish. The shark in the sea goes snap, 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 snap. The shark in the sea goes snap, snap, snap all day long. And I see some beautiful mermaids swimming in the ocean as well. And they're going splash, splash, splash. Are you ready? The mermaids in the sea go splash, 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 splash. Splash, 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 the mermaids in the sea go splash, 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 all day long. Good job, that was so much fun. Let's do that one more time. So what did we start with, do you remember? That's right, the waves. So the waves in the sea go up and down, up and down, up and down. The waves in the sea go up and down, all day long. Here comes the fish. 
The fish in the sea go swish, 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 swish. The fish in the sea go swish, 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 all day long. Uh-oh, donut, donut, donut. The shark in the sea goes snap, 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 snap. The shark in the sea goes snap, 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 all day long. The mermaids in the sea go splash, 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 splash. The mermaids in the sea go splash, 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 all day long. The waves in the sea go up and down, up and down, up and down. The waves in the sea go up and down all day long. Great job, everyone. All right, grab your scarf or dishcloth or towel or whatever it may be. Wave it around, give it a little shake out. Good job. <clears throat> All right, we're gonna do popcorn kernels. So take your scarf and you're gonna scrunch it up as small as you can inside your hands. You're gonna shake it. Popcorn kernels, popcorn kernels in a pot, in a pot. Shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them till they pop, till they pop. Great job, let's do that again. That was so much fun, okay. Squish it up, squish it up. Popcorn kernels, popcorn kernels in a pot, in a pot. Shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them till they pop, till they pop. Wonderful, great job. All right, one more time. Repetition is so good for us. Okay, scrunch it up, scrunch it up. Popcorn kernels, popcorn kernels in a pot, in a pot. Shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them till they pop, till they pop. Great job. All right. We wave our scarves up and down, up and down, up and down. We wave our scarves up and down. Wave your scarf. We wave our scars fast and slow. Fast and slow. We wave our scars fast and slow. Wave your scarf. We wave our scarves near and far. Near, so real close to you. Near and far. Near and far. We wave our scarves near and far. Wave your scarf. We wave our scarves in front and behind. Hi, wave it behind you, hide it. In front and behind. In front and behind. We wave our scarves in front and behind. Wave your scarf. We wave our scarves up and down, up and down. Up and down, we wave our scarves up and down. Wave your scarf. Wave it goodbye. Goodbye, scarf. That song was so fun and it's a great way to also learn your opposites and some fine motor control as well. You know, making it go really fast, seeing how slow you can make it go. All right, that's it for our mermaid story time today. Thank you so much for joining me. You can see all of our other story times on YouTube at EVP Library or on our Facebook page. All right, let's go ahead and get a rhythm going for our goodbye song. Bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say goodbye as loud as we can. Goodbye! Great job, what's the opposite of loud? We're gonna be really quiet. Bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say goodbye as quiet as we can. Goodbye. Great job, all right, now we're gonna say it as high as we can. We're gonna pretend we have a really squeaky voice. Bread 
and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say goodbye as high as we can. I'm so squeaky. What's the opposite of a pie? That's right, it's down low. Put on your deep voice. Bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say goodbye as low as we can. Goodbye. Great job. Now we're gonna go as fast as we can. Bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say goodbye as fast as we can. Come on. Come on. <coughs> Excuse me. Great job. All right, what's the opposite of fast? That's right, it's slow. We're gonna slow it down. Be super slow, just like a turtle. Bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say goodbye as slow as we can. Good.